Hi angels, hi my divas, it's LV Lux Girl back again with another video. So in today's video, I wanted to do a quick review of a bag that I've had in my collection for a very long time, and it's none other than the Louis Vuitton Balone. So this is my Louis Vuitton Balone bag right here, and she is a big baby. She is really big to put her and fit her in the screen with me. But I absolutely love this bag in my collection. So I wanted to talk to you guys about this beauty as well as a few other quick little things that I have on my mind. And if that's something that you're interested in, go ahead, hit this like, go ahead, give me a like, hit the like button as well as subscribe to the channel. You know what to do. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified anytime whenever I upload. So this is the size 35, which is a rather large size bag, you guys. It's a really large size vintage Louis Vuitton bag. And to me, the vintage and the new, they're, you know, really one in the same. I love the quality and the durability that you get with the vintage Louis Vuitton bags. Look at all that delicious patina. It's just so, so nice. And this is the, <clears throat> and this is the large size 35. So this beauty right here, I've had in my collection for a really long time. And I love her because she can hold so much. You can fit your wallet, you can fit a planner, you're gonna be able to fit all your necessities in here. I have a full size wallet in here, as well as my planner, um, a change purse, your keys, everything will be able to fit in here. And I'll have the dimensions for you somewhere here. And this bag came in several sizes. Don't quote me on all the sizes. I know it came in a 30, which is a smaller size, as well as a 35. This is the 35 that I opted to go with. I'm 5'8 and a little bit of a curvy girl. <laughs> so I wanted a larger size that would look really, really cute on my frame. And when I tell you this is a good size for me, the 35 is just so, I'm glad I didn't go with the 30 because uh, I just think that the 35 can hold a little more and it look better on me against my frame. And yeah, the patina on mine is really nice. So I purchased this a long time ago and I purchased it from an eBay Japan seller. I enjoy making my purchases from eBay Japan sellers because number one, I know that they, for the most part, I'm, I haven't had any bad experiences with them. I know that they have authentic items and you know, every time I made a purchase of a vintage Louis Vuitton bag, it always came back good in great condition, great description, whatever they described in the description. You know, I always found it to be true. So I'm very happy with this purchase. And like I said, this one can really hold a lot. This baby can really hold a lot. And this is such a nice statement bag. I'm not a hobo girl, but I like... <laughs> There was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait Our first time, our first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall
might be a little bit, I don't know. I, I, I think they came out a long time ago. They might be a little passe, but I still like them. So I had went ahead and picked up a few cold shoulder tops from Amazon. And this is one of them. They look huge, you guys. The reason they look so big is because they're supposed to, you know, fit you and be off the shoulder. <laughs> I'm making a funny shit position here. They're supposed to be off the shoulder a little bit, you know, like come this way. So they look big. They look really, really big, but they have that like phantom sleeve. You know, they have like, it's a bat wing. They have that bat wing sleeve that has that really, really long, you know, shape under it. So you're going to have a lot of material up under your arm because they have, they're off one shoulder and then they have a bat wing sleeve. So I have one in, in black here that I ordered and it's just an oversized one in black. And then I have one in gray and you can see I ordered, it's a really big, like I said, this one might be a little too big. Hopefully it shrinks a little, but it has a bat wing <laughs> sleeve and they're supposed to fit you really big. And I ordered it, um, and it's from, I got this one, I got them all from Amazon. So yeah, that way I can wear it off the shoulder, and then it'll still have that bat wing sleeve. This one looks huge. This one almost looks like a dress, you guys. So I'm going to be wearing that one. And then this one is so fun, and I got this one. I picked this one up, and you guys know I love black, but the one thing about black, black carries a lot of sometimes it'll pick up a lot of lint but this one says love and it's going to be you just wear it off your shoulder and it's a cold shoulder top it's going to look so cute when i put it on and just have it off one shoulder like that so i just wanted to talk to you guys about my cold shoulder top haul from amazon as well as my vintage louis vuitton as well as i just wanted to talk to you so i just wanted to talk to you guys about my louis vuitton balone 35 as well as my cold shoulder top my cold shoulder haul from amazon i hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to like comment and subscribe on my channel and you guys know you know i'm gonna be back tomorrow you know i'm gonna be back with another video <laughs> Bye. <laughs>